Hi pals, John here with the Lens Power, and today we're going to look at the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 6K Pro. What makes this an upgrade over the original 6K, which is continues to be a fantastic camera, cinema camera, and they've just released the new uh, Color Science 5 to work with the 6K, so they're still continue to, continuing to support that camera. So why release a pro version? What makes this a pro version? Well, first things first, this thing is a lot bigger than the original 6K. Main reason for that is we now have to house a longer battery. This is a Sony standard NPF 350, 550, 750 compatible battery slots in there gives you longer battery life over the Canon compatible LPE6 batteries. So that's one reason we've got to have a longer grip here. And honestly, like for its size, this feels pretty good in the hand. It is a little on the weightier side, but you know, if you're running this on uh, with a cage on with proper handles, you're not going to have a problem. We've got the same EF mount that we're used to on the 6K camera. So it's gonna take all your EF and EFS lenses and anything that you can adapt to that mount as well. And the other sort of physical feature that is gonna be of interest to some of you is this tilty screen. Now we can do tilty that way and tilty this way. So no flipping it out around to the front, but for those where you have a low angle that you're trying to capture or even a higher angle that you're trying to capture. This is actually a really nice design. Now I'm gonna kick it on right here and it's gonna wire up. On the back we've got the same system, same menus, um, same touch screen that we used to just with that added functionality of being flip out. One of the biggest new features to this camera is the inclusion of built-in ND filters. And what that allows you to do, for those of you who aren't perhaps familiar with ND filters, is you can uh, decrease the amount of light that is hitting the sensor without having to change any of your other camera settings. So you can um, have low ISO to keep the, the noise down on the uh, final image. You can shoot wide open. You can shoot with a lower shutter speed or a faster shutter speed if that's what you're going for. But you can use these ND filters to uh, decrease the amount of light that is coming in. There's a simple plus and minus, or I guess two simple buttons on the back. One is plus and one is minus, and you just use those to cycle through how, uh, how much stoppage you want, basically. Um, we have up to six stops of light that we can um, cut out of the final image, which is actually fairly impressive. And from what we can tell, there is no degradation in image quality. The ND filters actually move behind a sheet of glass. They sit bet between that sheet of glass and the sensor. So there's, um, Blackmagic has designed them to be that high quality uh, optical transmission. So we're good on that front. Other than that, this is the same Blackmagic 6K that you know and love, just with improvements. So. We're not gonna drag it on, we're not gonna bore you with like going over the same specs as the, the original 6K gets. We're just gonna call it right here, and that's a wrap. If you have enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, share, smash the bell, tell a friend. I, I don't know what the, you know what the cool YouTubers say at the end of their videos, do, do that for us, appreciate it. Until next time, we'll see you soon.